Welcome back to my channel of people. This is Playing 101 and uh, this is my gameplay for Resident Evil 7 Biohazard. I have to say, I love this game so far. It is creepy as hell. So if you guys are new, welcome. If not, welcome back. Thank you guys for all the support that you have been giving me. I really do appreciate it. So the last thing we did last time in the previous gameplay was to kill Margaret Baker. Don't know if she's dead for sure, but we killed her. That was one hell of a crazy boss fight. And uh, now we're just going to go right ahead and uh, resume. Oh, did we just collect some caca? Don't know. That was nasty. We're just going to resume where we left off last time. Oh. This is exactly what we just collected. And that was nothing nice. I don't know what the hell we just collected, but hey. We don't need this. Or this right now. I guess we can actually... Hmm. I have some chem fluid. Instead of carrying that, let's just... Uh, make one of this. And let's load this. Cool. Alright. I think we are good to go. Killing Mama was genuinely like one of the hardest things you could do in this game. So, do I need the scorpion key? I feel like we've been everywhere in the house. Anyway, I don't think we need the scorpion key right now. Well, let's just return uh, and uh, look at the doors that we couldn't unlock before because we didn't have the crow key. It's always like creepy to go in here. Okay. So scorpion, we don't need to go there. I guess we have to go upstairs. I, I was like thinking, maybe there's a door. Yeah, I don't know. I think there is a door in the basement where we need to use the crow key. That is not crow. That is a. Uh, that is a. Uh, what is that? Serpent? Snake. Yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Where the hell is daddy? So we open that. I thought I saw something else here. Turns out I was wrong. Shit, don't do that, bro. Do not freaking do that. Seriously, what the hell happened to daddy? We fought him, we, uh... Defeated him, but, uh... Guy isn't dead, let's face it. Guy doesn't die. Oh, God. I completely forgot about this bathtub. Okay, just making sure uh, we didn't leave anything behind here. Let's go back downstairs. I don't remember seeing a door with the... Uh, Crows in it. I'm missing something here. Hmm. Okay. Let's keep walking. I think there was definitely like a door in the basement area. I'm always paranoid of daddy because dude's like been terrorizing us. Oh shit. I didn't think this would work. Does it mean we can get out of this place now? No? No. So, at first I was like, whose car is this? 
is this Ethan's car? Because if that is Ethan's car, what is the purpose of giving us the key? Or the keys to the car? Then again, there's like motorbikes on top that we could probably use to get out of here eventually. If they worked. Doubt that they worked though. Okay, I don't think we missed anything else. Uh, guess we can't really get out right now. What is that? Okay. That was really helpful. So no one cleans up over here? I guess hygiene doesn't really matter when you eat caca for dinner, right? Jesus. I guess I'm growing some balls now because I usually, well, not usually, I before I wouldn't stop to uh, explore the area. This used to belong to someone, Evelyn. Uh, I do remember looking at the boots, uh, or the, at the boot before, but didn't really do much because, what was the point? We were being followed or chased by uh, daddy so I didn't really feel like exploring <sighs> that scared me okay I guess the only thing we can do is Let's go back to the basement area. I am pretty damn sure like we're missing something there. Whoa. Was this always here? I might. I guess it was. Just in case. I remember the maggots and everything, but I don't remember that room being this bad. Aha, okay. Boom. Oh my god. Oh my god, we just got a grenade launcher. That is both a good thing and a bad thing. Ah, shit. It's a good thing because we have a cool weapon. It's a bad thing because it means we're gonna fight a pretty strong boss. And I can't really grab the ammo, so I have to go back. What is that creepy noise? Let's go save. Get rid of some stuff and then we'll come back. I don't remember this being this bad. I feel like the black thing mold or whatever is taking over this place how long is this game not complaining great game um, I'm just curious because now that we were given a grenade launcher I feel like we are approaching the end okay um, cool
I don't know when I'm gonna need this, but since it doesn't seem that important right now, I'm just gonna get rid of that and this. This as well, actually. Okay, so let's go back and uh, maybe I should save again. Yeah, let's save because I should have actually, I should have saved before, um, you know, getting rid of stuff from my uh, backpack. Yeah, that, that would have made more sense. I'm sorry about that. Anyway, yeah, let's get the hell out of here. Let's go back there and grab the uh, stuff we couldn't grab before. Okay, cool. Don't really need gunpowder, even though it would be great to have it. Wait, we missed more stuff. Was just that really? Yeah, but how do you move them? That's the problem. Like, what if I wanted to equip uh, equip the uh, grenade launcher? I cannot because it's not part of the. Uh, I'm gonna call it the quick access uh, menu. And I don't know how to change that. Let me try this. Nope, can't change it. Oh, okay, so if you look at the top left-hand side of the screen, it says, basically that's our mission. Find this, the arm in the old house, 2F. Open the old house, 2F door, which is second floor. But the um, the arm wasn't there. For sure, the arm was definitely not there. This is, uh, I think this is, yeah, this is the old house. And if you go to the second floor, it wasn't there. I have no idea where to find that thing. And before leaving, let's just make sure we didn't miss anything else, because I have a bad feeling feel like something's about to happen. Don't know what. Kinda don't wanna know. What? Okay, um... Let's get out of here. Let's go from here. Let's go this way. Alright, so in order to get to the old house, we have to get out of here, through this door. Alright, let's go back out here. What is that place? Oh, wrong way. I bet you that is uh, the son's place. Yeah, I bet you that's exactly what it is. Oh shit. She's alive. Did you guys see this? The candle's turned on. Ah oh, shit. So she's not dead. God damn it. The candles didn't turn on, the candles lit. You know what? I could be wrong. It could be the flickering effect. And I somehow missed that. Oh 
Who the fuck is playing the piano? <laughs> Jesus. Oh my god. There's no one here. Okay, so this is what we read before. I put the present in the secret room, right at the back of the second floor, where nobody will find it. That arm is a sign of the child's trust. Okay, um, back of the secret room in the second floor. Don't know what the fuck that means. But this is getting creepier and creepier. This is the second floor. Thing is, where is the secret room? I know we, we looked before, but maybe... Now that we have the... Um, good fucking lord. Now that we have the... Uh, the lantern, we'll be able to see it. Oh shit. That is correct. We needed the lantern to solve this puzzle. Okay, okay, and I freaking left the lantern away. Damn it! All right, I have to go back and get the lantern now. Stupid thing. I believe I did that. Okay, the quickest way of getting the lantern Unfortunately, is since I don't want to fight the wasps, for me to get out of here, go back to the trailer, get the lantern, and come back here. Yeah. I completely forgot about the lantern, by the way, so that sucks. My bad. Okay, so let's get that thing. Come on, bro. Put that here. What do we not need? I guess we don't really need the gunpowder right now. Do we also need the grenade? You know what? I'm going to keep it. Just... I don't need it. If I need it, I'll come back. Put it away. Put this away. Again, I could be, I could be wrong, but hey... I, I don't want to carry stuff around that we won't need. Especially because the grenade launcher, I, I don't know how powerful it is. But in previous Resident Evil games, they are pretty powerful. Um, and I usually save them for like, hardcore boss fights. So I don't, I don't know if I'm going to use them until maybe the end. Okay, so now we have the lantern. Hope nothing creepy happens again. Let's solve this puzzle, open this door. Let's equip the shotgun just in case. Boom. God damn it. Oh my god, that scared me. Oh shit. Oh shit. I have a bad feeling about this. Is this Zoe's room? Is Zoe just, is <clears throat> sorry. Is though is you know what? Let me drink some water. Is Zoe the child? Jesus. Shit. Oh 
Oh god. Oh god. What the fuck's happening here? Shit. Uh oh. Shipwreck. No. Oh, <clears throat> I mean, yeah. Cool. Oh, God. I don't like what I'm seeing. I should have brought the fucking grenade launcher. Oh god. <sighs> this does remind me of Death Stranding, by the way. Some something's wrong with her. Something is definitely wrong with... Oh shit. What's happening over here? It's so dark. So fucking dark. Uh oh. She is fucking alive? Well, are the root source of the uh, powers? There's something behind that wall. What is this? A map. I don't fully understand it though. House. Don't know what the fuck that is. That is how you escape. I bet you we won't be able to get out of here. Through this door. Nope. I'm glad I didn't really bet any money on it. But we should be able to get out through here. Oh, fuck me. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Oh, God. That is creepy as hell. Oh, good lord. Oh. I guess this is it. Oh. That is nasty. No. No. No, no, no. Oh, God. Okay, none of this shit was here before. None of it. So this is another fucking boss fight. Oh no no. Dude, I wanna fight you. I can't fucking f fight you if you don't move out of the way. This is seriously fucking creepy. Oh 
Oh god. Fucking Capcom making me shit in my pants. How many fucking shotgun shells am I supposed to waste here? I fucking hate these things. I do. Oh shit. Oh fuck, this one is not dead. Well, I don't need to kill it. No need to waste ammo here. Okay, I'm finally out. Well, I'm finally out. Don't know if I'm actually out. Why? Why? Why are you doing this to me, Zoe? Did you find it? Yeah, I got it. Are we really gonna be able to make serum with this thing? It'll be fine. After we make it, we can get out of here. Together. I'll be waiting for you in the trailer. Alright. Jesus fucking Christ. Why do I have a bad feeling that I'm gonna have to fight everyone and their mother before getting to the trailer? My heart is beating like crazy. Someone waiting for me out there? Thank God. So she fucking lied. Where's the phone? Now where the hell are you? Traffic? You know, never mind. We only need the head and That is not her. And this is gonna help me and me, right? Hey buddy! I thought you should know. I decided that Zoe needed a time out. She and Mia are here with me. And they're keeping each other company. Just let them both go! What do you need them for? Nah, uh, uh, that's family business, Ethan, and not your concern, understand? <clears throat> now, if you want the head, feel free to come by any time and I'll give it to you. But only if you participate in a little, uh, activity I've put together just for you. What activity? Oh, oh, oh I know you're excited. But don't worry, it's not going anywhere. First step I need you to take, <laughs> partner, is for you to take a peek inside the fridge in the trailer there. Fuck you. Oh, come on now, don't be like that. You want to have fun, don't you? Now, look in the fridge. Fuck me. What the fuck did he leave in the fridge? Mia's head? What the hell is that? Oh, the deputy's head. I had a feeling we were gonna fight him, but guess not. In the dissection room. That is in in the in the old house, right? On the second floor? No, that's the detention room. What the hell is dissection? Oh yeah, 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 I know what it is. 
I know where it is, right there. In the basement. Okay. Anyway, guys uh, and girls, thank you for watching my gameplay for Resident Evil 7 Biohazard. Really appreciate it. And thanks for all the support that you guys have been giving me. I'm going to stop this video right now because it's already reached the 30 minutes mark. But you guys will get to see me fight the weird dude next time, I guess. I, I don't know. I think it's going to be a boss fight. Especially because they gave us a grenade launcher. Um, thank you. Take care. And until next time. Bye.